video I'm going to show you how to speed up uTorrent 2.2 and 3.0. There's going to be two steps in this video. The first is selecting the fastest torrent to download and then the second is configuring uTorrent to be faster. If you already know the difference between Cedars and Leechers and how to pick a fast torrent you can look in the video description and there will be a time you can click it and it will skip past the instructions on how to download a faster torrent and, how to, and it will skip you to the part where you can start configuring uTorrent. But if you don't know how, you should watch this part. Once you've uh, gone to your tracker and searched for your torrent, you're going to see it's different in every tracker, but you're going to see Cedars and Leechers. You're going to want to look through all the torrents, find multiple ones of the ones you want, and you're going to want the one with the highest number of Cedars and the lowest number of Leechers. The more Cedars is the faster it will download. And the best way to do this is not actually use one tracker, but is to use a torrent search engine. I'm using torrents. There's a bunch of them. You can use whatever one you want. Yeah, I'll search for this. My legal torrent, by the way. And see, here you go. It has a big list of them. And where it says peers, there's the ratio. This is a. This would be a really fast one. This would be. This would also be a really fast one. And then. One like this, a 3 to 1, that would take forever to download, especially for an operating system. So the key is to pick, you want to subtract leechers from cedars, and the biggest number you have will be the fastest download. Now that you know how to get fast downloads, you can go open the uTorrent program, and you're going to need to make some changes. You're going to want to go to Options, Preferences, first setting you're going to want to go to is connections and you're going to want that number to be between uh, 40,000 and 65,000 because those are the best ports to work on. Next you're going to want to go over to bandwidth and where you're going to want your max upload rate at zero and you're going to want to go down to the number of connections and I'd rec you have to, it's good to keep these in multiples of 8 and these are just the two I like to use 104 for the global number of connections and the maximum number of connected peers per torrent at 72 now you're going to want to go over to queuing and you're going to want to put the uh, seating percentage or maximum ratio at 200% the faster you seed, the faster you can download. So, so you're going to want to do that. Now you're going to want to click under Advanced. And you're going to want to scroll down to Net Max underscore half open. There it is. And you're going to want to put 8 in as that value and click Set. The next value you're going to want to look for is 